Stalingrad, the city that arrested the Nazis' eastern expansion. Had the city fallen, Russia would have crumbled. The Germans underestimated Russia's will to survive. They underestimated the city and her defenders. The people looked to Polina as a symbol of hope. But she didn't want to be a hero. She wanted only vengeance. The arrogance of the Third Reich was to think they could achieve what the great Napoleon did not. Perhaps if they weren't facing someone as fierce, as Lady Nightingale. There. He heard Steiner has been creeping around the commercial district. Makes sense. He's never far from the slaughter. So much. Let's go. Now wait, but we should see who the earth's little other families know. Knife. Short! That's a sniper shot. Precise. But we, you think they still... might be. Okay. There's more cover this way. Come on. So how will you kill Steiner, Lady Nightingale? I told you to stop calling me that. The name gives the survivors hope, Polina. Hope would win this war. Boy, oh boy. The dusters. To followers of Lady Nightingale. Anyone who gives asylum to this terrorist will face the most severe penalties. Let's go up this way. Do you think the sniper could be one of Steiner's Jaeger murders? We should be more careful. Polina, do you hear that? Take a look. There, on the right. Steiner. Where is he going? He's driving towards the commercial district. You may be right about those Jaeger murders, Misha. Let's move before we lose sight of him. Misha, be careful! Shit! Get down! What do we do? Ready when you are! Now, Misha! Move it, Devon! Get down! Now! Devon, Devon, Devon! Get down! Incoming! Spot. 
for one sniper and stop. So, they're much tougher than I thought. Well, you didn't have to fight him. I help. Let's get out of this field. I got him! Be safe for now. Two Jaeger murders. You must have been worried. It means we're getting close. Let's keep moving then. Look, Steiner's vehicle. I can't shoot him while he's in there. Let's try to get closer. I can't wait to put a bullet through Steiner's head. Wait. This is bad, Polina. We can't strike from here. There's too many of them. Take a look. Shit. Steiner. There, on the right. Bastard. He might be Steiner's superior. Sniper, get down! <laughs> you okay? Misha! It's not as bad as it looks. Just hold still and let me check. That doesn't sound good. It's not. We don't have time for this, Estroja. You hear me? I need to get you somewhere safe to patch you up. You're not going to die here. Up! Let's move! I'm getting you to the post office. We'll be safe there. Steady your breathing! Oh. 
Isn't going to get us out of here. Look, we need to finish, please, for all of us. No, you're delirious. Come on, we have to move. Valina, go! No, you cover the opening. I go out and flank them. There is no time. Go. I will slow them down. I know you are Steiner. here somewhere. Bastard. You will not get away this time, little bird.
Sie kann nirgendwo hin weiter suchen. Men have eliminated far deadlier threats than you, girl. You are all alone in here. Bastard. <laughs>
die Hund von dieser Plage! Is this the best your Nazi fucks have to offer? Bleiben Sie wachsam! Dame Nacht ist hier irgendwo drin. Bewegung! Bewegung! Tod oder Leben! 
Without your rifle, Lady Nightingale, you are exactly where I want you. Scurry along, girl. You will not escape Stalingrad alive. You cannot hide forever, little bird. <laughs> You have not faced me yet. <laughs> Russian bitch! I know all about you, Paulina. Poor little nurse. Fuck! Jesus! Why you're so angry? You think I'm 
You fucking Nazis! We'll all die here in Stalingrad! You took everything from me! Now it's my turn! <coughs> you won't find satisfaction in this. It won't end with me. We'll destroy you all. You won't be doing anything. Not me. Herr, Herr Freisinger. He will finish what he started. It's your turn! The Shiske! Spinia! All you've left me is this night. could help you. Incredible. You're all the same. I've killed more of you than I can count. And you all spout the same pathetic bullshit. Freisinger. Is he supposed to scare me? Another piece of fascist filth. Don't worry. I'll hunt him down next. <laughs> you thought you'd take my city and crush my people. You tried to break me, but you failed. You created Lady Nightingale. And now, she's destroyed you. Infamous Lady Nightingale brought Stalingrad back from the brink. Her actions inspired the Russians to take back their city and go on the offensive. Polina changed the course of the war for the Allies and her people. With that reputation, it was only a matter of time before we found her. What would Freisinger want with a lowly officer on the Eastern Front? What does it matter? It matters a great deal to me, Fraulein. Nice lighter. From what I could gather, Freisinger was recruiting Steiner for some special project. Project Phoenix. Could be. All I know is... I was sent to kill Freisinger.
got to be a better way out of here. There is no way out of here. Unless, of course, you have decided to do the intelligent thing. Open that door back up, and I'll show you the intelligent thing. You can get me out alive? What? I can. <laughs> you two-faced bastard. All right. I'll tell you what you want to know. <laughs> Typical Aussie. No honor, no loyalty. in your crusade, Tommy. I hope your plan was worth it. Break a leg, Lucas. I thought you'd be the one to put an end to your team's foolish agenda. You're killing each other now, are ya? Sir, look! Sir, look! Skinnies. Haven't you heard about the Aussies and the Brits? We were the pieces of shit flushed down the crown's dunny. Yes, yes, of course, but your nations are allies. It was more like master servant. I did what I did because to every Brit, folks like me are expendable. Insubordinate, churlish, no stranger to a prison cell. That's Lucas. You had to credit the SOE. They were very good at spotting talent in the unlikeliest of places. And Lucas had talent. He was a skilled demolitionist with an explosive temperament and a sharp tongue. Out there in the desert, the rats of Tobruk were like a family. Unfortunately, they never did figure out how to get along with the brass. Today, Princess? I'm savouring the moment. Oh, I'm so sorry. Of course you are, Your Highness. Hey, Bluey, wake up. You're gonna want to see this one. Oh, fuck me. Play the damn cards. <laughs> All right, Des. Read them and weep. Oh. Fucking donkey! No way! Why the bloody hell aren't you at your post? Uh, Major Hems, we thought... We thought you'd muck around. Major, convoy's approaching. Right. You rats, follow me. Try and act like real soldiers for once. Sir. Oh, yes, sir. No, sir. Three... See? That's what a real soldier looks like, mate. <laughs> oh, what a way to stand up to him, Bluey. Good job, buddy. Fuck off, Des. What's guy's even doing here in the first place, huh? He's a major. He can do whatever he wants. You're lucky. I was about to make me come back. Shut up, Des. You've never beaten me at anything. What? Ah, oh, mate, pull the other one. Explosives are ready. Lucas and I set them ourselves. Sir? Man your position. The timing must be perfect. I need you all to focus. You got eyes on them? Quiet on the pad. Hang on now. What's that in the lead? I said be quiet. 
Ah, ah, ah. I'll do the honors, thank you. Yep. Sir, Mark is that first rock. Yes, I know. That's a tank. Well, <laughs> Germans have tanks, Private. Yeah, but the armor's too thick. We didn't pack for a tank. Bloody hell. Hit the treads. It's the only way you're going to stop I, it. I, I, I need focus. No, no, sir, wait for the treads. No, no, wait! <laughs> It's a mine. <laughs>
saw that. All right. We'll search the area. But then we're leaving. Hey, I found something. You read Crow? A little. Of course he does. It looks like one of Rommel's officers checked through here to visit a camp up the way. I don't know what kind. I don't recognize these symbols. Then we go take a look. The Krauts just lit up the sky. More could be coming. No, we return to base. Report to the Major. We can't report a thing if we don't know what it is. That wouldn't be good soldiering, Jacobs. Fine. We'll scope it out. Let's tread quietly this time. Ugh. This road should take us directly to the camp. Yeah, straight into those cracks. Get off the road before they see us. Into the ruins. I told you they saw the flare. That glow on the horizon. It must be the German camp. I say we stay off the road and we cut through the desert. Get to cover quickly! Going the right way. I'm going the only way, you dickhead. That's enough, Des. This isn't a joke. I need a drink. Talk with your man, Hams. He's got plenty. What? He's never shared a sip from his fancy flask? Well, there should be plenty to go around. He's a bloody lightweight. If I ever get my hands on that wanker's flask, it's my shout, fellas. Hang on. There's a light up ahead. Looks like we found the German camp. Where is everybody? Probably out looking for us, I reckon. <laughs> Hold on, what's all this? Who cares? Look at this. I think the chap on the left is wrong. Who's the fancy bugger? Seriously? We're gathering intelligence. Something you obviously lack, Private. Hilarious. You sort your papers. You know what I see? 
I see a ton of shit outside that goes boom. Now, what do you suppose we should do about that? Uh, well, we should blow it the fuck up. <laughs> That's what I call target rich. Motor pull on the left. Ammo dump just ahead. Gas depot on the right, just asking to be lit up.
From the inside, I'll cover you! That was glorious, Lucas! Wait, you guys hear that? That's a play! Coming round again!
night in Libya, an Australian private and a group of rats had given Rommel a huge black eye. Their actions should have earned them medals, and maybe even a shred of respect. Hams didn't see it that way. Their reward was some time in the brig. However, all Richter seemed to care about was Rommel and his connection to Freisinger. That fool would listen to Lucas as long as we needed him to. did Freisinger want with Rommel? I thought you wanted to know about our team. Answer me now or our deal is off. Okay, okay. Don't get your undies in a twist. Lucas piled it on like a champ. He didn't have to tell Richter anything more than the lies that Nazi already told himself. That was the Third Reich for you. Their reality was delusion.